guys welcome to my channel oh my god it's such a pleasure to have you and today guys I'm in such good mood because I am looking at some clothing items in my closet that just brings me joy and it goes without saying that I cannot stop grinning about these items. They, they, they make my day, all my nights, my summers, my spring, my winters. And that's because they were intentional and mindful purchases. Yeah. Hence the reason why I tell you to do that. So guys, yes, I'll leave you some tips on how you could be imperfectly sustainable. So let's just jump right into it. Number one is this coat. This coat in my closet, I don't know if it's the floral appliques or it's just the silhouette or simply the fact that it I got so many compliments on this or maybe it's the natural material that is a hundred percent cotton and this is a piece that's gonna last me forever in my closet it's all of the above I absolutely love this piece every time I bring it out it gives me such joy oh my god and like any trench it goes with everything everything absolutely everything in my closet i love it let's go yeah i'm like an addict do i gotta have it i ain't even playing got a really bad habit if it moves about five or seven years old now this is a beautiful piece and I absolutely love it it brings me joy for the reasons mentioned above secondly and maybe I'll stick to the coat section first oh! this piece Guys, the second I saw this piece and a six foot two person was wearing it, I knew that this is a piece for me because it's going to drag on the floor and I'm going to love it to death. This is one of the third pieces that I brought into my closet that I told you that, yeah, I felt ashamed to have brought it in, but it brings me joy so much more than one of the other ones. I love them. I cannot say I love them equally. This because of the length and the fabrication. It's so thick, guys, guys, guys. I love this piece. So much it's a piece that while well, I do that to all of my long leather coats or trench coats I wear them as dresses and I style them creatively look at the length of this guys who's gotta grab it fuse like a magnet lose won't have it till I'm doomed in a casket I ain't playing, got a weird mind. If you work eight hours, I'ma work nine. If the shit tastes sour, you should taste mine. I'ma stay in power for a long time. Get up, nah, I ain't a quitter. Toss me the ball, I'm a really big hitter. It doesn't get any better than this. It's absolutely a joy to wear. It's, for me, this, this is the one. It would be forever in my closet. Unfortunately, I have to let one or two of the other ones go. Yeah, one is already up on my Poshmark, actually. So yeah, oh my gosh, the next piece, and because we're sticking with coats, it's new in my closet. I got it a few months ago. 
This is vintage Yves Saint Laurent. Yeah. The reason why it brought me joy is because, guys, I have a thing for lining. And this red piece just, just, yeah, it, it does it for me. As well as the fact that as a trench coat, it's very warm. So it's not just for spring and, and fall. No, this piece, this inner layer that is attached, it makes it very, very winter friendly. It's detachable, yeah, and it's gray. I've always wanted a trench coat. And so I got this thinking that my husband would wear it, but it's too small for him. The sleeves are too short. So I got it. He thinks, <laughs> he actually thinks I got it for me, but I actually wanted it for him. But since, ah, since trying it and I've worn it, ah, I love it. I love this piece. Big picture. I'm a it's not as long as I expected it to be. It's as long as my vintage um, Burberry. Straight killer, rising the song to the highest bidder. Got juice, got gas, I'ma move fast. New shoes, new tracks, like who's that? I'm so I'm okay with it. It's warm. That's what I love. I love about this piece. So, be for those reasons, this brings me joy. <laughs> now on to some of my grandpa blazers. Guys, the next best set of items in my closet are these grandpa blazers. <laughs> my tweed blazers. Oh my god. I have not stopped wearing these pieces since I got them in. Um, was it last year? last spring so they are one year all in my closet but they are vintage pieces bought these from a guy a, a really really this guy is he's a dresser and i got this from an online platform i just love them they just they go with everything absolutely everything Thing. and you may have seen this piece in a last video because I wear them I wear them see it has in my mask I, I wear them to death it's a piece that is so versatile you could style it up like this to go on a dinner date yeah to brunch yeah they are not season specific for me. I would wear them any time of the year. If there's a cold summer day, these would be popped on. Yeah, I love them. Who come back better than last year? It's a new me, never gonna look back. I'm never gonna look back. Cause damn, I was built to last. You move slow when I move fast. And that's facts. Only I can make a change. It's for that reason why it brings me joy. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely love these two. I just I I just love these. These bring me joy. And I might add a hundred percent wool pure virgin wool seriously Harris Tweed one of the oldest wool manufacturer in the business it doesn't get any better than that when you hear of Harris Tweed it's quality just quality yeah the next thing that brings me joy, it's this Fee Noel denim 
high waisted wide leg denim pants that every time I see it, I just start smiling. Ah! Yeah. I'll just show you how I style it. Slowly take a step today. I will never be the same. Cause that's what it takes. anywhere I could dress it up I could dress it down it goes to the Caribbean when with me I've worn it so many times so many places in fact a, a couple of weeks ago I wore this to a, a live band event I wore it there yeah yeah it certainly is an attention grabber yeah I, I i it brings me joy a hundred percent cotton and this would stay so long in my closet that no other water would be wasted on unnecessary denims this for that reason this brings me joy <laughs> what else do i have that brings me joy in in terms of clothing this denim piece I got this maybe earlier this year or late last year guys it's by Parasuko I believe yeah this brings me so much joy I swear I put this on every single time I'm in the home it it just looks pretty it's very flattering it's such 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 a gorgeous fit and it did this piece it didn't even cost me it probably cost me forty dollars it's vintage and guys it's the the quality it's the real sturdy denim the real McCoy that's why I said to you guys Vintage is the way to go. As long as you have an eye for detail, you have an eye for when something would suit you, and that you know your silhouette, you know your style. Yeah. As long as you know that, you'll be able to find amazing gems on the second-hand market. This barely use i think i'm using this more than the original person i love it it definitely brings me joy because also it bears with everything almost everything spaghetti strap dresses spaghetti strap Camis, anything that is sleeveless, jumpsuits, ah, yeah, pants, yeah, <laughs> it brings me joy for those reasons. I can go on and on, but I'm going to stay there for now. You guys got the picture. You understand. This is not a he, it's not a she. I don't like to do that. It's an item. If you refer to your items as a she or a he, why then that most people end up selling them or dumping them or sending them away? Is that how you would do to your child? If you 
feel like you're fed up of him or her, that's what you'll do. Yeah. Anyway, just saying. I don't want to personify them. It, it doesn't have life. And if your items are so beautiful, why then do some people treat them like crap? Just saying. You only bring stuff in your closet that brings you joy. Be mindful, be intentional, and your pieces would definitely work for you in the long run. You would always feel excited to wear them. Of course, there may be a walkwear edition that brings me joy. There may be a dress edition that brings me joy because I'm staring at one right now. But let's just let's just make this short and sweet for now. So yes, guys, hope you have learned something. Hope you get inspired. I love you guys and I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Bye. Think with my head not hard, I've been chewed up, spit out, torn apart, but picking up all the pieces is a form of art.